Hello? Yes, Mr. Ayub, you are live on air, my friend. What do you want to say to us? I don't know if you were listening to the topic. Did you listen to the topic? We are live on air. Yes, I uh, just uh, joined in. All right. So what do you think about what do you think about uh, the, the jelly story? Why what the, is the story? Why the Muslim will think that the jail is Allah when he comes second time and when he, when he come at the end of the time? No, no, Muslims don't think that. Muslims don't think that. Who say? Okay, I want you to listen. No, no, look, look, look listen. Okay. I want to explain it to you, yeah? Okay, before before Ooh. before you explain, let us see, let's make it clear okay. for you. Okay, before you explain, because we don't want to waste our time and your time, you know, my friend. So listen to this video. This okay. is your this is your brother. He is a sheikh, you know, and he's explaining what will happen that you know people will think he's Allah. Why? Because simply this person obviously he will do a lot of things. And there's you know tons of videos in the internet you can watch them, and even I can show you what your prophet said. So let us see what this person will say. The jail will come and play uh pretend and claim to be Allah and he will command the, the heaven to, to rain and it will rain and he will give life to the dead and he will do some 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 extraordinary things uh, uh, did you hear it that the Jal will come and he pretend to be Allah what do you say well it's uh, I have delay you did not hear the sound of the person no no wait Okay, hold on. I think I need to play on my phone. Oh, no, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. I will, I will, I will make it work for you. Hold on. I think because uh, I'm using the microphone, my microphone, I have to unblock my... Uh, hmm. That will be a problem if I do that. Uh, let us see. Okay, you know what? Forget about this guy. Let me show you what your prophet said. Did your prophet say that He's afraid that the Muslim would think he's Allah? Uh, I don't think so, no. All right. No, no. I will give you a hadith. You can open it in your side if you want. Or you can see it in my screen if you want. Just to be sure to mute uh, mute uh, pal talk so we don't have double voice. Uh, this hadith here in front of me, and I will post it for you. You can read it in your pal talk. And I will give you even the link. It says... That but I, you need to show me Sahih, yeah? Yeah, Sahih. Don't show me yeah. yeah, this is, you know, I know Islam is full of weak things, right? I mean, you are, you are saying... No, 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 no. You, you, you need to show me from Sahih only. If you, if I, you don't I, show me Sahih, I don't want to see it, okay? But this is weak, so what we would do now? Yeah, if it's weak, then so, I don't want to see it. So, so what weak mean? What weak mean? What do, you, what do you mean by weak? What does that mean? If scholars say it's weak, then I don't accept so what does that mean? But when you say the scholars say weak, what does that mean? If you show me hadith, you need to show me authentic. I understand. What we what weak mean? Don't show me authentic, then I, I what, don't accept. But what weak mean? Does it mean like fabricated? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. So you Muslims, you 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 write in your books lies about your prophet? No, we say that. You just no say, one say that. You just said it's fabricated. No, I say if it's not authentic, then it's fabricated. No, okay, so who, but who, so who is the one who wrote this fabricated story in your book? Then isn't it you Muslims? Who is uh, who is Al Bukhari? Who is uh, uh, Mus uh, Muslim? Who is Ibn Majah? Who yeah, is... they are scholars. Huh? Okay, so why they are writing yeah. those stories? You just said it's fabricated. Why are you Muslim? You write fabricated story about your prophet. No, but I say to you, if they are, they rate the. Have the, the, so, but if it is if it's fabricated, why they are writing in a, in, a, in their book a fabricated story? They should say this is garbage. We throw it away. We will write what is you know what, what the okay, point. We'll okay, listen. We we'll say that. Okay, no, no problem. Listen. listen. Well, listen, listen. Sure. No, listen, listen. This yes. is this is a sahih hadith. The hadith I just showed mentioned to you is sahih. So let us stop playing the game of weak. I mean, I wanted to show the people anything. We show the Muslim right away. They say it's weak. Anything is they don't like, they call it weak. They don't even know what the hadith is about. Maybe they never even heard of it. Anything they don't like, they say weak. Just to throw it away. Okay. So listen. so now listen, listen. listen. Wait, wait. So listen, listen. This is Sahih. So what we will do now? You're a prophet saying, I am afraid that you are going to be confused and think that the Dajjal is Allah. I say to you that the Dajjal is as the following. He described him that he is short. He is fat. He okay. is... Uh, huh? 
Uh, show me the hadith. You. Uh, I give it to you. I, I give it to you in, oh. in Pal Talk. I give it to you in Pal Talk. You carry it there too. Wait, I need to show, uh, see the hadith. Hmm. Okay, the Prophet said, I have told you so much about it. Well, yeah, this is a description of the uh, Dajjal. What's the problem with that? Exactly. But Muhammad saying the difference between him and Allah is just one eye. Yeah, no, I, no, you don't understand. See, the, the, what we think is that when the, the Antichrist comes back, that the Jews and the Christians, especially the uh, the Jews, because they believe in the Antichrist, ah. so they, they believe that it, it's God. Do you get what I'm saying? Uh, but no, my friend, Muhammad is speaking to the believers, not to the Jews, not to the Christian, and the Jews don't believe in the Antichrist. No, the Jews, you don't understand. No, I understand. Read the hadith carefully. Muhammad is speaking to the Jew, to the Jews, or the Christians, or to the Muslims. He's speaking to the Muslims. So he said to them, I have, yeah. to, I have told you so much about the Dajjal, the false messiah, and I'm afraid you might not understand that the Antichrist is short, hinted, uh, woolly-haired, one-eyed, and eyesightless, and neither protruding nor deep-seated. If you are confused about him, know that your Lord is not one-eyed. So okay. what he's afraid of him, that the Muslims are confused because Allah and the false messiah, they look exactly the same. So Muhammad now is giving no, you. No, it doesn't say that. What, it doesn't no, say that. Well, what do you mean? It's in the front of you. Okay. What the difference between the false Messiah and the and mean, Allah, my friend? The Messiah is a human, correct? The false Messiah is a human. Yeah, yeah. The real Messiah, the real, the real Messiah, according to Islam, he is just a human. He is not God, right? Uh, yeah, okay. Sure. Yeah. So the false messiah is claiming to be the messiah. So why Muhammad he is his worry about you Muslim thinking that Allah is the false messiah when well, he's a yeah, man? Because you don't understand. Look, 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 listen, listen. I will, I will explain. explain when okay. the false messiah comes back, look, look, when the false messiah comes back, yeah, mm. he will deceive people and people will, he will do miracles and people will believe he is God mm. because you believe but this is not a my, man is God. But, but this is not my question. You see, the Muslims are one to believe him, not us. This is not us. Muhammad is afraid that the Muslims will follow him, not us. Not, not us. Yeah, of course. So, 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 so how Muhammad? Okay, how Muhammad make you now able to recognize that this is not Allah? He said you should know that Allah is not one eyed, right? So yeah. this guy he have a problem. He looked like Allah exactly. He's short. He have curly hair. Is neither it's in the front. It's in the front of you. What is the okay? What is the only? What is the only? Okay. How, how many eyes Allah have? It doesn't matter. No, it matter for me. I want to learn about Allah. I want to convert to Islam so I can get the seventy-two versions. What do you mean? Doesn't matter. I want to see. I don't want, I want to see how Allah he see me. Do Allah he see me if he turn his face or he yeah, see he me? See, he sees all see. Okay. So your prophet saying he's not one eyed. How many eyes he? How many eyes he have? I don't know. Maybe, maybe two, maybe five thousand. It doesn't matter. Well, that, he doesn't have one, and well, we if know have, this if, if you have five thousand, that will make him a spider or a bees, you know. But you see, uh, the, you're, you, well, oh, I'm not making fun. You know, your prophet says the only difference between the false messiah and Allah is one eye. Okay. Do Allah have a hand? No, Do Allah have a hand, my friend? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's yeah, true. Man, that's true. How many hands do you have? I don't know. Two hands. And I can show you the hadith. Will it say that? Okay, here we go. You could show fake hadith again? Or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you Muslims, you have a lot of fake stories, it looks like, you know, because anything we show you say it's a fake no, story. No, you make a fake story, because last time you lied, uh, you lied. Ah, I lied. I remember, you lied. Ah, okay, I lied. Okay. You lied about that. Yes, listen. Last time, because I want to ask you a question uh, after. Uh, okay, finish. read with me. Because last time okay. you were right about Zakir Okay, you can ask me, you can tell me about the lies as much as you want. Here it says, it says, and his both his okay. hand, he Allah, he have two hands, and both his hands, both his hands are right hands. So not only Allah have two hands. It's in the height, in the height in front of me, it says that, and both his hands are right hands. So not only he have two hands, he have a birth defect, he is born with two hands in the right. I don't see the. Oh wait, it's 
I have delay maybe on my screen. Wait. No problem. Is it a hadith? It is a hadith, yes. <clears throat> Wait, uh, okay, I see it now. Okay, those who are just I also must play. Uh, those who are just in their release and the days of And both his hands are okay. Okay, so what's your point? You said to me, uh, uh, I said Allah have two hands. He no, said, no, no, I didn't say it's not true. I said, where is the evidence? I didn't say it's not true. Okay, okay so, no so now so now we are we are forming a man. Allah have two eyes, Allah have two hands, Allah have two feet, Allah have two, uh, uh, two arms. So this is a man. And now the prophet saying, I am afraid that you will think that the false Messiah who is a man, you will think that he is Allah, you know? Why Muhammad? I explained to you, I explained you, to you, listen, listen. I explained to you, people will think that because, for, for example, you believe that uh, Jesus God because he did miracles, for one example. Wow. And a lot of people thought that about the prophets in the past. Hmm. So that's why what, uh, the Antichrist come back. People like atheists and Jews okay. and Christians and even Muslims. No problem. Heard, listen, listen. I'm listening, my, listen, listen, my friend, listen. my friend, but your Sorry. prophet, your prophet, he did not tell them you recognize him because he have bad miracle or he said the only difference but, between them is one eye. You should know that your God is not one I eye. I didn't say that that's the only difference. He said that, he said that, okay, that. From, all all the, from all the description, isn't it enough to tell them that he is short, etc. Why you are comparing him to Allah eyes? If he is short, just tell him he's a man and that's it. People will know that he is a false man anyway. He's a man, he's not God. You know, as long as he's coming as a man, why are you going to be confused? Think he's, he's God. Because if miracle, you Muslim, you believe that God is not a man anyway. And if the guy is saying, I am the Messiah, he's saying, yeah. I am. That's why you call him the Messiah, the Dajjal. You say, I am the Messiah. So the man is saying to you, you are the Messiah. And you are a Muslim who believe the Messiah is a man anyway. So why you think that he will be Allah? Okay. Okay, so who is going to think that? Uh, sh uh, explain to me then. The Muslims. If you think I don't understand. The Muslims will think that he is Allah. Wait, let me read the hadith again because I don't think you understand. I have told you so much about the Dajjal Antichrist that I'm afraid that you may not understand the Antichrist is short and tall. Will you add one eye and eyes? And neither for truth nor deep seated. Okay, so who is he? Is he speaking to his companions in this hadith? What do you think he's speaking to the Hindus? Well, I don't understand what you are. I, don't, I just don't get your point because I already told you. My friend, your prophet, who, who, listen, who, who, listen, listen, who, listen, who listen to the teaching of your prophet? Who your prophet talking to? He's talking to his companion, obviously. I don't believe in this madness. So this is wait for you, not for me. So your prophet is worried okay. that you will be confused. Do you see the word confused? Okay, if you are confused about him, him who? The false messiah. He's not, and no, he's not only talking about, listen. Hello. Hmm. I'm listening. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, let, just let me finish, okay? Hmm. Okay, listen. I already explained to you. It's also about Muslims, but it's also about other people. So if the Messiah, that's how we, well, how I see it. If the Antichrist come back and he will do miracles, because it's also in other hadith that he will do miracles and people will follow him and people will see him as as, as God. Hmm. So also it's talking about that Jews and Christians, etc. will fall. And but it's also said that Muslims who are weak, uh, weak in their faith will also follow him. Hmm. So I just debunked you already with that. Because you said it's only about Muslims. Hmm. So what you got to say today? I to, I told you it's in another hadith. I don't well, remember you know, which one it is. But to be honest with you, with, well, your, your answer so uh, your answer remind me of a prophet Muhammad. There's a guy. He is blind. He come to his house, and then he said to his wives, <coughs> "Cover yourself. Cover yourself." And then the women, they said to him, the wife of yeah, Muhammad, they said, hey, he's, but he said, they said to him, but he's blind. He cannot see us, nor recognize us. He said, are you blind too? So I am saying the same to you. So now you are saying to me that this hadith is for everybody, not only for the Muslims. 
and yeah, there's some because okay uh, okay hold on and then and then the only way to prove that this false messiah is false is he don't have Allah don't have one eye what does it have to do with Allah have one eye or two I thought oh you Muslims no I understand you, the answer is very simple he don't have one eye the only difference how we can know that this is not Allah you should know that your Lord is so not one eye. I'm not saying your prophet saying that the only way to find out if he is Allah or not, ask him to take off his sunglasses and look at his eyes and tell him, look me at the eye. Look, no, no, look, 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 look here, look here. And if he have one eye, that means he is not Allah. You have two eyes and they are fine. This is Allah. That's what he's saying. I explained to you a bit of that. Okay, you know what? That's your interpretation. Okay, is there any? What is the interpretation for this? Okay, from other people. Uh, there's no. Uh, there any, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. Uh, the, the, I will make it simple for you. The Messiah, the false okay, Messiah, yeah. he can uh, he can cut a person into pieces and make him alive again. How he can do that? Well, the, by the power of God. Uh, so the false Messiah work for Allah. What? What are you talking about? You just say to me. Are I you talking about the false messiah? I just, I just say to you. I just say to you how the false messiah can cut the pieces, a person, two pieces, and he put him together again. You said that the power of God. Yeah, of course. Okay. How, how, how else? So Allah, He gave him the power to do so, correct? Well, yeah, of course. How else is he going okay. to do? See, so, God, we don't believe in three gods. All like right, two. hold on. So is that is the false messiah a bad person or he's a good person doing the plan of Allah? I don't know if he's a bad person or a good person, but he's a deceiver. So why uh, you okay? If he is a deceiver, but he is just working for Allah, so the real deceiver is Allah because Allah he sent him. No, 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 he doesn't work. Okay, no, let, no, he doesn't let us work let us go back to zero. Who is the one who he gave the who is the one who gave the power to the false messiah to make people come back to life to command the rain command the ground even he can he can ask the ground to bring gold out and the and the gold and juries will come out so who is the one who gave him this power I want the answer yes Allah will give him the power Allah gave him the power so what's your point how does it make okay. Islam fall if I, okay this this bad person. He will, he's not exist now. Allah one day will create him and then he will give him the power and he will send him on us, correct? To do bad, correct? Okay, go. I want to understand your point. So Allah is doing his best to deceive us, correct? Allah will send us a trick. No, no, that's not true. What do you mean no? That's no? not true. Okay, you, okay, let's go back to zero. That's not true. Okay, let's go back to zero. The, who, the, is the one, who, is the, who is the one who gave the Listen. power? Who is the one who gave the power for this person? Like in Christianity, let, 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 me, let me help you. Let me help you. In Christianity, God created Satan, but he created him as an angel. So the power he gave him, he did not give him the power to be a Satan, he gave him power to be an angel. In Islam, the story is different. Okay, hold on, hold on. Here, we have a person, we have a person, he right now doesn't exist. Later, Allah will create him. We do not know when, maybe now. Who does not exist? Allah will create him. Who is the one, who, who is going to create uh, the Jal? The Jal, who created him? No, no, I, the Jal, he already exists. What are you talking about? He already exists? Where? No, no, it is in uh, another hadith that he is on an island. He's what? He's on a, he's somewhere already. Ah. He's locked up. Oh, he's locked up. Okay. Who I, don't, I don't remember the hadith. Uh, okay. I'm sure it's, uh, it's attended. Yeah, I remember the hadith. That was a genie, as I know. But I know anyway. So let us say I will go with you. So the Dajjal is already okay. exists and he is locked up. Okay. Who is the one who created the Dajjal? It's, uh, it's God. Okay. And who is the one who gave him the power to make those miracles? It's God. Okay. And God will let this Gizjal come and so us. I don't know if I say God is bad because he gave him the power to do that. Your logic is flawed, bro. Honestly. Okay, you know what? I will change my logic. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will switch my logic upside down. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. I will switch my logic upside down. That the Gizjal is locked up by who? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Like, you know it's he's, not relevant. You, you know he's in jail, but you don't know which jail and who is the one who, who arrested him? 
No, he's not in jail. He's just on an island by himself. Oh, an island. I wish, oh, man, I wish that is me. He's fishing yeah, there, right? Like an Fish island, the coconut tree. So he's an You remind me of an angel. His name is Futros, which Allah, he broke his wings and he sent him an island which has isolated because he commits sin. You know the story about Futros? No, I don't know. Where, where yeah. is that? Sorry. Yeah, maybe later we will talk about it. We'll leave Fatras alone because now I feel sorry for him. Allah, he broke his wings and he put him in this island and it's very hot there. There's a lot of coconut, by the way. It's hell fun, but there's no beautiful girls there. So, so, so when your prophet, he said those oh. stories to you and you said to me that he is locked up in an island. Where are your prophet getting those stories from? What are you talking about? It's from, uh, from God. Allah told him that? Everything, listen, 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 because you, you are a deceiver, Allah. Listen, I will tell you something, yeah? Hmm. Everything that the Prophet did, he did not by his own wisdom, he did by God's wisdom. He did what, he what, 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 what? So all these... What? What? Well, I don't understand what the Prophet said. I don't know. You say, I said to you, where your Prophet getting his stories from? You said from God. Where in, where God he said that to him? Can you show me the Quran in front of us? doesn't say anything of this. I, I, don't know, I don't know if it's in the Quran or in Hadith, but somewhere it says that everything the Prophet did, he did not by his own wisdom. Okay. Everything he did, God uh, okay. did. Okay. okay. I want to show you. you. You mentioned to me that the Dajjal is in an island, correct? Yeah. Is it true that the Dajjal was a pirate? What? He was a pirate of the Caribbean. Are you trying to make a joke? No, he, no, 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 I am not. I here we, here we go. Here we go. Hey, okay, here we go. Here we go. It says here that there's a story that the Dajjal, he was sailing in a boat. He was sailing in a boat with 30 men. And they are from certain tribes. What are you talking about? Listen, listen. I will explain to you because well, well, you don't know where you're talking. The hadith about. in the front, listen. my friend. Listen. The hadith is in the front of me. Don't tell me what are you talking about. A Dajjal was sitting. Okay, where it says that? Uh, this is uh, uh, in Sunan Ibn Dawood, and this is Sahih. So don't play the game of week yeah, again. But it's a long hadith. I don't. Hear. Yeah, it says it's a long hadith. It says Show Sahih me. hadith hadith number four three two six. Four three, two okay, six. Well, okay, it says here. Here okay, we go. Uh -huh. Okay, read it for me then. I don't, I don't see it. Okay, hold on. Give me a second, please. Go on. Because it's a long hadith. Yeah, it's a long hadith. You are right. I mean, I, everything Muhammad is says is very long. The only short is his logic. So here it says. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, his logic is short. They say Alhamdulillah, wonderful. Okay, he says that. Yeah, okay, what I was, you know what, what I was telling you about the Dajjal. Listen, listen, what I, I was I, I was telling you about the Dajjal. He told me that he sailed with thirty men of Lachem and uh, uh, Judam or Jadam, you know, and those are supposed to be people from like a tribes or etc. And then they were stormed and tossed for a month and they draw near an island. When the sun was setting, they sit in a boat nearest of them and they enter an island where they met by a very hairy beast. Look at this story, how beautiful it is. Are you are you with me, my friend? There is a very hairy beast. Where is this hairy beast? I don't see that. It's in Hadith in front of you. And remember, you are the one who told me about yeah, you. My friend, isn't it you who told Maybe me about... Maybe I am behind. Maybe I am behind. Yeah, but you are the one who remind me, right? You said to me that he's, he's an island, etc. This is the island story. So he yeah. uh, so he was in a boat, and then the, the boat, there is a storm. And then the storm, they throw them in an island, and inside there's a woman, but she is very hairy. Very hairy, you know? And then they said, we to you. They said, we to you. Uh, what can you be? Like, you know, she's so scary, man. I replied, I am a Jassasa. Do you know what a Jassasa is? I am the Jassasa. Hmm. So what does it mean? You don't know what a Jassasa? Does it mean I'm the Jassasa? Huh? Does it mean I'm the Jassasa? No, but the Dajjal, he discovered it. Now, the Dajjal is in a boat. The Dajjal is in a boat. And then the storm okay. took him to an island. All right? And then uh, there in the okay, island. So I was right. I was right. Okay. So is that a fiction story or real story? 
why it should why should it be fiction? I I told you before that he was an island. So if he went on a boat and they got an island, that that fits in the story. So it's no contradiction. It, it fit with the story. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, let yeah. us let us guys. Okay. Uh, so this is this is uh, this is the the, the jar. He went to an island, and then in the island he said to them, yeah. "I am the Messiah." Right. Okay. Okay. So now you see we confirm that the Messiah exists. He will not be created, as you said. You see, I said maybe he will create it. Maybe he does not exist, right? But you said to me he exists, and now I agree with you. He exists. Where is the Messiah now? Yes, what are you talking about? You're talking to yourself. I already explained to you before. Where you, 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 <laughs> you, did, you did not you, you did not give me anything. As you see, he's a free. I got you busted. He's a free. Okay, so what's the problem with the story? So your prophet is a liar because if the Messiah is already exists in his time, and the Messiah is a free, yeah. this false Messiah, and he met with the Jassasa, but all of those are the signs of the Judgment Day. So Judgment Day must be happening in the time of Muhammad. So when I told you he's not created, he's not exist, I wanted you to tell me, no, he's exist. So later you cannot deny it because Muslims, if we say to him he's exist now, they will say, no, he's not exist. If I say he exists, they will say no. If I say he's not, they will say yes. And that's what I did. I, well, said, I, said, you, I said he exists. Yes, I, exactly, exactly. I said to no, you, I, I said to you, listen, I said to you, he does not exist. He will be created later, maybe now, right? So I said, this I said, maybe. And then right away, you voluntarily, thank you very much. You said, no, he exists and he's locked up in an island. Okay. So now the first Messiah is exist in the time of Muhammad. He will not come in the judgment day. Unless the judgment day was in the time of Muhammad. So yeah. Muhammad is a fraud. Because as you see, he came and he I'm met with the Jassasa. Do you know who's a Jassasa? I, I don't know. I already told you I don't know. No, the, 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 I the, think... Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, go. In the Jassasa... Let, let me explain. The Jassasa is a beast, exists in the Quran. If you go to chapter 27, verse number 82. Yeah, you, you must, a beast or something. Uh, yeah, know. yeah. So al Jassasa is someone will come in the judgment day. So how Muhammad he claim that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> are you are you getting what what you what you did now? You just made your prophet a joke because you just said that you agreed that. What this are you is, talking about? Okay, is 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 that Jassasa will come in the judgment day or no? Yeah. Okay. So what? But as you see, al Jassasa she met already with with the with the false Messiah in the island. Okay, sh show me where Jassasa is uh, the beast from the Quran. Show me. Here we go, chapter 27, verse number 82. And when the word of torment, which means the judgment day, fulfilled against them, we shall bring out from the earth. We shall bring out from the earth. So she should be down in the earth, not on the top of the earth. And which will speak to them because of mankind believe not in what certainly in our Quran. So Allah in the judgment day, he will order the beast which, which is this woman with a lot, a lot of hair you know uh, my friend take it easy are you okay, okay. are you okay no, no i'm sick but uh, it doesn't matter well, with me. i hope you will be okay, fine so where is the... okay so this beast will come from the uh, ground when in the judgment day correct Yeah, that's what I remember. Okay. Uh, that's so, it's in the that's it's the same. So okay. so how in the hadith says that the Jal he is already there and the Jassasa is there and they meet an island. Yeah, but where does it say that uh, Jassasa I already told you where does it say that Jassasa is the beast from the Quran? Where does it does say that? Yeah, here we go. Let us see. Let us go to the Tafsir. I know, I know that in the Quran it says that uh, yeah, we go, we go no problem. We go to the Tafsir, and because you know, if I say to you, it's you know, you will say to me, This is your opinion, etc. You know, so we don't want to do that. Okay, the, no, ch the chapter, about that. the chapter of the end, verse number two. Okay. Sorry, verse number uh, 82. So, what are you going to show me now? Okay, I will show you. Here we go. This is the Tafsir about the beast will come from the ground, and this is in the judgment day. All right. Here it says, this beast will emerge at the end of the time. Do you see it? This is a Mika theory. No, but I don't speak, uh, I don't speak Arabic. I'm not showing you Arabic. I'm showing you English. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's not in the screen. Okay, now you see it? Take your time. I go to translate or... Uh, hmm? Because I cannot read Arabic. Are you going to translate? My friend, I'm not showing okay, you Arabic, so I'm showing you English. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I so, have delay, I told you. All right. So, a Jassasa, this beast, will come at the end of the time, not now, right? Who say this? Who say this? Uh, who, trans uh, who say this? The Quran. The Quran says, no, no, who is the commentator? What? what? Who is the commentator on this? Ah, uh, this is Ibn Kathir. Okay. Huh. Okay, go on. Okay. So, this is, will be at the end of the time. Where this beast, who is a female, she have a lot of hair, and uh, you know, I mean, that's very good to have a lot of hair if you're a female. Can you zoom out? Can you zoom out? Huh? I want to read the full. Uh, I want to read the full commentary. Can you zoom out? You are zoomed in. I can see. Okay, it. no, I would. I would do even better. I'm going to give you the link, and you open it from your side. Is that okay? Let me give you the link. Okay. I will give I'm it to you in me. your Skype. Here we, here we go. Let's just see. This is the link, open it in your side. This way you, you will not be waiting for me to scroll down and go up, and you will be able to read it right away. Uh, so what, where, where do I read? Because there's a lot of text. Do I read from, everything? From the, the, from the beginning, it says the emerge, the emer, the emergence of the beast of of the earth. I'm I'm starting from there. It says this yeah. beast, this beast which will emerge at the end of the time when mankind become corrupt. Correct? Yeah. Okay. So the hadith, your prophet, he okay. said that, that uh, the false messiah he met with the Jassasa is a fraud, because she will emerge from down the ground. No, she I is not at the top that. of the ground yet. She will emerge from under the ground, from the earth. And she is a beast who live under yeah, the I, ground. Huh? I know, I already, I told you, I know that. But I told, I asked you, uh -huh. where does it say that, uh, what, what is the name that you said to me in the hadith? Just Sasa. The name you said from the hadith? Just Sasa. Yeah, where, where does it say, how do you know that means the... The beast, how do you know that? Every, every Muslim he knew that. We, we can show you oh, tons. Huh? Hey, well, go, let us, let us go. No, I don't know that. You don't, I know, don't that. know that. My friend, because you because are. It doesn't say that. In the because, no, because, because you are just a normal Abdul. You do not know. But this is the name which all Muslims they use, and your prophet he use. If I go right now to the hadith and then I search for the word just says, hmm. I just type the word just says, so you will see tons <laughs> of stories which you do not know about, obviously. Because you are an average Abdul, all of them they are saying it just says. Here we go. Listen, listen. I want after I want to ask you also a question. Yes, you yes. need to be. Uh, yeah. I want to ask you something from. Okay, okay. Your Bibles. Uh huh. Uh -huh okay. You do not even know your book. You want to talk us uh, talk us about uh, what? Why you want to jump and you run away from? It? Come on. I'm no, no. Listen. Here we go. You see. Uh, okay. This is, I need to say this is this yeah. is this wait, is wait, all. Wait. This Before is you... this is all. It's wait, a wait, wait. story about a Jassasa. and a Jassasa she have. Uh, like she have a special description as you see and uh, let me show you the description of the sasa because i like it by the way uh, uh like she have ears like elephant you know uh, let us see it says that jesus is a woman he go up go up yeah. oh you are a liar man i am a liar, liar bro. why i'm a liar why you are a liar. why why i'm a liar why if you go up it says that uh Jassasa is a woman, so you're a liar. I got you busted again. Okay, guys, you can be busted. So Jassasa is a woman, correct? So you see, you agreed that Jassasa, you agreed that Jassasa is a woman. But when I told you Jassasa is a woman, you said no. I am the one who told no, you. No, you that. didn't say that. No, I am the one who told you she's a woman. No, no, because I said she is a woman. No, and no, she's no, very, she that. is a woman, and she is very hairy. I said that. Everybody heard me. It's recorded. People, they can play the tape, and you said no. Who said that? You know. Okay. Go now, back, so now, go back to the so now look go what happened. So now look what happened. You just agreed that the women, the Jassasa is a woman. But look at this uh, description of her. How a woman she look? She have this description. Let us see together. Here we go. I want you to read with me, and you have the page in the front of you. And you know, you agreed that a Jassasa she is a woman. So we will not have a problem. Read with me. 
It will strike the nose of the no, believers. It's in the hadith. Hold on. Yeah, 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 in the hadith. All of this is a hadith. All of this is coming from your prophet, your phony prophet. Look at this. He says, no, this is, uh, okay, this is from it's the, also reported, uh, it's also reported by Ibn Majah and Ibn Juraj, reported and etc. Describe the beast. He said, it's head like the head of a bull. Have you ever heard of a woman? Her head is of a bull. But you're a prophet. He says she's a woman, according to you, correct? No. And its eyes, I, I, I like the I eyes. Her head is a head of a bull. Her eyes is the eyes of a pig. Her ears are the ears of elephant. And her horns is like the horn of a stag. And her neck like the neck of a, of a uh, ostrich. And its chest like the chest of a lion. And its color like the color of a tiger. Oh, <laughs> and her hunches, its hunches like the hunches of a cat. And its tail like the tail of a ram. And its legs like the, 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 like the legs of a camel. All of this, is, is, you think it's a zoo? All of this, and you said she is a woman. So your prophet is, a, is, a, is an idiot. How she is a woman, and she, no, uh, she is a woman. Hold on, you are the one who said to me no, she is a woman a second ago. Listen, how can this be a woman? This is an animal. But you are the one who told me yes. she's a woman, and you tell That's me I got you. Animal. You forgot what you did. You said I. You no, said that. Is, she, is a, she is a woman. I got you busted. You said that. No, no, no. How is this a woman? How? <laughs> you tell me. You're the one who said to me it's a woman. <laughs> and I agreed. <laughs> no, no. Listen, listen. listen. Now, this, okay, hold on, hold on. <laughs> do, you, do you see the story here in front of <laughs> us? Do you, do, you, do you think your prophet is telling a real story or he is a, he's a crazy man? Be honest. Do you think really there's a woman? She have horn. No, no, no. She have head of a bull. You're, you're a eyes of. Okay, I'm, I'm showing you in the you're screen. I'm showing you in the screen. How you call me a liar? So I get, and I gave you the link. It make a theory. I gave you the link. You are reading it with me. And this is your scar. It make a theory. And those are your companions reporting what your prophet said. And then I am the liar. And you said you said yourself. I got you by such as a woman. Everybody heard you. So I am the one no, who no. I am the one who got busted by you supposedly, and now we discover that this woman, according to your prophet, she have a head of a bull, she have eyes like eyes of a pig, she have ears like ears of an of an elephant. No, listen, you don't. Understand. This is interpretation. This is interpretation. What interpretation? You he described. No, read. It says he described the beast, and he said, describe the beast, not interpretation. As Zubair described the beast and you said, what? <laughs> what you show me now is interpretation from a first. Exactly. What are you talking so about? why the why the interpretation saying this? If it is not, it is. It, it is. Why why is it easy? Why the scholar? Why why you the scholars and your prophet companion and your prophet? I right now. You can You want to hold your breath. You're lying. <laughs> You're a liar. You're a liar. Okay, let me, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Is it true that this successor is going to have the ring? Yeah. Is going to have the ring of Solomon and the stick of Moses and will make all the 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 Muslims white and all the Muslim black? It, is it going to make all Muslims yeah, white I and all non-Muslim black? Is it true? What what do you see in there? Is it this beast? Her duty, Allah, He sent her for a job to do. She will hit you with the no in your nose with the ring of Solomon or with the stick of Moses. And if she hit you, either if you are a believer, Allah will the Jesasa, she will make you white. All Muslims, Jesasa will make them white. All non Muslims will make them African because Islam is a racist cult. Do you agree with that or not? You are a liar. Okay. Who doesn't say that? Okay, read with me. I am a liar. Okay, get me busted. You have the website. Yeah. Read, read with me. Read with me. It says here. It says here. Here we go. Let us read. And it will bring with her. Because you. The, uh, 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 it, will bring, it, it, will, it will bring with her the staff of Musa and the ring of Suleiman. There will be no believer without making a white spot in his face, which will spread until all his face shining white. Do you see it? As a result. And there will be no disbeliever. Yeah, but why? Left without making a black a black spot in his face, which will spread until the face of the face is a black as a result. And you, are, you keep saying to me, "You're a liar." He will go in front of you. What kind of God he? What kind of God he says such a thing? So you, so you Muslims are racist. You claim that all bad people Allah will make them black, and all good people Allah will make them white. So all the people will go this to is, heaven. This is not. This is what. Listen, listen. No, no, this is not about uh, skin color. 
Yes, because it's about what is being okay. I'm, I'm lis- okay, I'm listening now. I'm, I'm, it's not guys. It's not about skin color. Explain to us. It says that the, if you are not a Muslim, it's going to hit you, and a black spot will be in your skin first, and then it's going to extend, 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 extend until we became all of you. We became black. Explain that to me. Go ahead. Listen, I told you already. This white and black in this context uh-huh. is not about skin color. No problem. Tell me about this what because I'm, we I'm, also okay. I'm listening. Go ahead. What? I'm listening. Explain. Listen. Explain to me. I'm you listening. Know, let me finish. You know what Noor uh, means, right? Ah, uh, Noor. I know what Noor. What is Noor? Yeah, Noor. That's like the light. Somehow, uh, if you're yeah. a good believer. Yeah, I have a flashlight. Okay, what about it? Yes, that's what we believe. That's what we mean with with uh in this context because it says shining white it doesn't say white you're a liar again ah, not only white you are shiny so you're extreme white uh, you, you, you will be extreme white right Clever. what no, no it doesn't say that well, it's, it's just shiny, shiny, okay, shiny okay okay what about the black like a diamond. What, okay what about the black what about shiny, the black okay. you see now you want to hide behind the shiny okay let us see it says here that it's going to make a black spot in his face which will spread until his face is black as a result there's no shiny here can you hide behind shiny now in the first one you hide behind no, shiny black is dark. huh there's no shiny here here we go shiny there's no shiny the goat ate the shiny no <laughs> What? Listen, listen. Is it going to make his face black? Does it, does it say shiny black or it says black? So the Muslim not only will be white, will be shiny white, which means extremely white, but the black will be very black. So your God is a racist, no, that... claiming that everyone who is bad, Allah will make him black, and everyone who is good, believe in him, Allah will make him white. Proof in the front of you. I told you. And by the way, I by the way, I, I don't know, I don't know. Your name is Ayub, right? Ayub, listen. I am not against this, by the way. I wish Allah will make me black because finally I will get a girlfriend. It's my dream. I will oh, become a black. God. Second day, a girlfriend will will, will like me. Right now, nobody like doing? me. Women they hate me. Doing? So I'm. So now I have. Uh, for me, I, I have no problem if Allah make me black. Being a black is not an insult to me. I would love to be black. I would love to be Asian. I would love to be Filipino. I would love to be Indonesian. I would love to be African. I don't care. A human is a human. We are equal. Nobody is better than anyone. You are bad when you are do bad. When you are ugly when you are doing ugly. So your God, your God is a very fitting God. And those are all fiction stories from your fiction prophet to your fiction religion. How listen, listen, even if you are black, you don't get a girlfriend. How you get a girlfriend? You're in your basement all day, every day. That's my first thing. Exactly. My second thing. Exactly. Listen. See, how listen. I'm going to get a girlfriend and sitting in front of my computer. See, so because I love God, for I love God, I don't care about girlfriend. I was joking with you, you idiot. It is you who worship Allah for the sake of your penis. Listen. You, do, you do jihad. You do jihad to get what versions. You do jihad to get version. You get jihad to do to be white. You do jihad so Allah will give you. Is it true that your prophet says you will have you will have seventy years orgasm? What kind of religion teach you that if you have sex in heaven? Huh? Listen, listen. I'm going to explain to you. Explain to me what? Here we go. I'm listening. Okay, why Allah? Listen. Why Allah will make the person who don't, don't believe? Okay, I'm listening. Why Allah? Why Allah will make the person who don't believe in Him a pure black? Go ahead. No, listen. Uh, I will explain to you both. Hmm. See, shining white is what I said before about the nur. That's the, the, if you shine. Really? That, that's so what you do with you're Muslim, what nur? You, you will be yes, light, you will be the, made of light. No, when he says shiny, you know, shiny white, it means shiny, oh, shiny uh, snow. This is what snow is. Is reflecting the, the the, but it's so white. Okay, listen, listen. It doesn't say that. Okay, the, 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 okay, okay, okay. The, uh, when your God, He promised you those little boys in heaven. Are they black or white? They are gray. They are gray. Let me finish now. They, uh, they are gray. Listen, listen. Let me. You, you, are, you are making. What is the problem with you? Or you, they are. You are making. Are pink. Maybe you are, they are pink. You, you are making fun of Allah now. Okay, that's one. Here we go. It says here they are white. Oh. They are like white, very white, hiding pearls. Because you don't let me. My friend, chapter thirty-seven. Oh, oh, oh. Chapter thirty-seven. They are white pearls. Extreme white pearls. Read it. So this is your Quran, and this is your Islamic translation, funny translation. Huh? So they are extremely white, like pearls. 
like white eggs. Yeah, so what? Birds have no skin color. What are you talking about? What do you mean they have no skin color? Ah, the women, they have no skin color. No, the women, they have a skin color in the heaven. Your prophet, he says, he, they will be so white to the point they are transparent. Because when a person is extremely white, you can see the blood under his skin. You can see the, the vein under his skin. So your prophet, because, because he's... Your prophet, because... He, your prophet because he is obsessed he is obsessed he's obsessed with white color so what he do he promise you that no, you're obsessed with black color okay let us see I, I, I saw what's wrong with the black color I, you know black people are beautiful people I love them all my neighbors most of my neighbors are black they are wonderful I, I love them all I have a woman she is like eight years old I go check on her almost mm -hmm. every day every day mm -hmm. I go and check on her to see mm -hmm. if she need anything so listen listen Listen. Oh, no, 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 listen, listen. Is it, is it true? Is it, is, it, is, it, is it true that your prophet, he promised you women, they are so white to the point you can see through the mirror of their bones? I don't know. I know. You Why are you asking me this? You don't know? I know because we are talking about this topic. Here we go. You're a prophet, he said, that I swear by Allah that each one of you will have, etc., you know, a reward. And then he said, they are so beautiful, pure, transparent. The marrow of their bones, of their legs will be seen through. And the bones and the flesh. Okay, so what? Why? Why they are transparent? Why they are not? Why? Why they are not normal black women? Why is? Why there's no black women to promise for Muslim men in heaven? Why all of them they have to be white? Transparent is not white. Huh? Transparent is not white. No, transparent are, is not white. No, trans, no transparent is. They are. They are so white to the point you can see through. What? What are you talking about? Okay, I want you. Transparent is not white. Okay, okay. listen, listen, listen. Is, is that a beautiful image? The woman he is promising you now to have a transparent woman you can see the bones yeah of course it's beautiful of course okay let us see how beautiful. it looks like okay this is very beautiful here we go so this is this is one of uh, uh, uh mr ayub wives and she is very beautiful here we go you see how beautiful she is so you are saying to me that your god he will promise you your god he will promise you a bunch of bones you know and according to you this is very sexy this is very sexy and this is very beautiful. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know what to say to you, my so friend. What? Yeah, this is very beautiful. <laughs> What's wrong with that? I don't know. Do you see anything wrong? Yeah, I like This is so There's beautiful. There's something different there. Look at those. Look at those possession, brother. Unbelievable. Oh, look at this. Yeah. So, so the, 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 the point, oh. the, the point is that obviously all the stories your prophet he said is a cartoon. Maybe you need. Oh, but I'm and, and just says uh, a woman she have a lot of hair she have a big eyes she have a horn she have elephant ears oh. she have a chest of a, of, of a cat she have a tail of a tiger like what, what the heck is this so and this is not metaphorical by the way. I can take it if I can take it if it's a metaphorical if it is about metaphorical but your prophet is, your prophet is a your prophet is a thief he took a story from the book of Revelation about a bee about a beast so your prophet you, you Muslims are very funny. You steal stories from other books, and then you add, you add your own spices to it. So listen, listen, listen. So are you are you are you convinced? Are you convinced? Be me, be honest with me. That the story about the Mes the false Messiah taking a, a boat and going in a ship is a true story. I explained to you. you I explained to you. No, what's wrong with you? No, you did not. Is it a true story? I want you to tell me. When this guy he took a boat and he go and he met the beast. In the island, is this is a true story? Yeah, it's true. Maybe it is true. What is the proof of this story? Listen, you didn't even show me if it's a uh, if it's authentic hadith. You didn't even show me. So what if it's not authentic now? So it's not authentic. But tomorrow is going to be authentic. Just wait until tomorrow. Okay, so then it's not true. So it's not authentic. It's okay, here we go. It's authentic then. I just changed. Oh, you it said that. No, you said that. I said to you, it's not authentic. No, tomorrow that. I will make it authentic. Tomorrow came so fast. Here we go. It became authentic. It says Sahih al Albani. Yes, and this is that. No, 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 no. Authentic, not authentic. It's authentic. Read it. It says Sunan Abi Dawood four three two six authentic. Everybody can read it. It says Sahih. Yes, sir. Listen. You showed me like. You already showed me like five hadiths. No, 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 no. showed me one. I showed you that, that, that this one. No, no this one. I, I'm asking you about no, the one. I just asked you no, about no, the no, one no, in the. No, in, no. I just asked you about the one in the boat. 
This is the one in the boat. I told you he's a pirate. Yes, okay, and he met a Jassasa, and you said, I don't know if it's uh, is it authentic. So it is authentic. So it's a true story that a Dajjal is a free and is going okay. around. So what is he? If he is, if, 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 if he is, if he is a free, if he is a free, I'm if he is exist, if he, okay, if he exists, this is the question, and then you can explain. If he is exist in the time of Muhammad, okay, and Muhammad he said that this is happening in his time, okay. Where is at, at the, uh, where is this guy now? Where is this beast too? Go ahead. What happened in his time? What, what do you mean? You mean this uh, story? No, as long as he is a free, is the guy is a pirate. He have a boat. He go from island to island. As you see, he met with a Jassasa, perfect team. She is a beast. He is a false messiah. Both of them, they are very powerful. She have the the, the ring of Solomon and she have the stick of Moses. She got all the the magic of the Lord of the Ring. So now, by having have having this happen, no. what happened to those two? Why they are not here? Why we don't see them? Do you think they have connection with the Trump? Which two? Which two? The Jassasa, the beast, the Jassasa, and uh, and the the Antichrist, the false Messiah. Do you think like Trump he hide them, or do, okay. they, do you think Obama is involved in this, or maybe Sarkozy, yeah, yeah. Or, yeah, or, or Yasser, Ar or Yasser Arafat, or what do you think is happening, brother? Yeah, yeah. Maybe maybe Hamas they got him locked. Listen, listen. What, what is this? Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe. Listen. Huh? What? I'm I will explain. I will say. Okay, I'm listening. You know, uh, you know. Uh, okay, listen. Okay, mm. finally. No. Because you talk a lot of uh, stupid things, uh -huh. you know. You know the uh, Google Magog, right? Yeah, I know Google Magog. I, I, I they actually we are friends. I'm we not, we go to the park together. To, what, what listen, is? I'm not going to switch uh, subject. I'm not going to. I'm giving you example. You know, Google Magog. Uh, it is they are hiding, right? They are hiding where? Well, I, you know, CP, let's just continue. You know what I'm talking we about. We are continuing. Because no, now we're going to switch. No, you have to tell me. You, you said they are hiding. I'm asking you where they are hiding. I don't know where. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? But uh, just agree with me so I can uh, go on, yes? So like, but okay, they are hiding where? Are they hiding underground? Oh, my God. Are, are they hiding underground in the yeah, top they, of the ground? Are they under the ground or in the top no, of the ground? No, no. I think they are uh, they are on the ground. I think in the ground, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the Quran says that he brought, he built the dam between two mountains. Have you ever heard mountains under the ground? So this is Alexander the Great. He oh, found. Yeah, he true. found. Uh, no, no, so, okay, that's so, true. That's true. Okay, so I you mean, agree. That's wonderful. You agree. So now it's above no. the ground. Okay, how come we cannot find them? So oh. Alexander the Great, he built, it, he, he built a dam. Oh, I will, I'm letting you finish. I will see. I, I like you, my friend. Actually, I'm going I'm to make you. I will like make you. I will make you an admin in my chat room when we are not live. From now on, when we are not live, you're an admin. I promise you. Now, listen. So the dam is built and between oh. two between two mountains, and now they are behind the mountain. Why we cannot find them? Go ahead. I'm listening. Okay, I don't know why we can't find them uh, because it's uh, it's uh, a sign. It's not yet happened, so it's a sign for them the the last hour. How comes? So it's not. But how? Happen. Okay, but how comes Zul Qurnain He found them. <coughs> is Zul Qurnain is a man, a human like us, or is not? Zul Qurnain, He is the one who's talking. You know, the, the, Zul Qurnain, the, the guy with the two yeah, horns. he's also yeah, but he's not normal. He's he's also in the Quran. If I uh, don't. Uh, yeah, he's in the Quran. We are showing you the verse. Uh, yes, this is the guy who he found where the sun set. He found it set in murky water, which is true. Scientific. Oh, I know you're going to say that. No, 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 no. We, so we will not go good. there now. So they, he came to those people. He told them those people are attacking us, and they are like not a human. And now, so and now you need to build. Yeah. You really need to build for us a dam. So he built the dam. Okay. So the dam is in the top of the ground. How come we cannot find them? Especially your prophet. He says one thousand from here. Your prophet says their number is 1,000 from them, one from us, which means if we are 7 billions, they have to be 7 trillions. So how come we cannot find them? Maybe they are very small. How do you know? So why are they are afraid of them if they are so small? Maybe. Who is afraid? Those people, they ask, they ask Zul Qurnayn, the guy with the two horns, please protect us, build the dam between us and them. They are doing mischief, man. And your prophet claimed that all of them, they are scary. They will, they will swarm the earth. And not only that, they will attack the earth and they will attack even the yeah, city. They will come to the city of Medina and Mecca. And then they will, they will, uh, they will use their, uh, their arrow. Correct? 
but, but what you're saying, no, listen, listen, let me, let me just, I, I got a headache because I don't want to uh, scream over you and mm. shout over you. Mm. Listen, let me explain to you something. Mm. What you're saying about why we can't find it. Also, remember, we switch now to, to a subject because you didn't let me finish, but I will go. You're the the reason who... why we can't, it doesn't, listen. You're the one who mentioned reason to why me. We can't, you're, uh, the, you're the one who mentioned to me, Gog and Magog. I will give you an example. You're the one who I mentioned you an example. Yeah, example. The example is horrible. So you, you switch, you switch, you turn off the light and you say why it's oh. dark. You turn off the light and you say why it's dark. What's wrong with you? Come on, Abdul. So now, those Gog and Magog, okay, they are hiding. Listen. But you're a prophet. Listen, you're a prophet in his yes, time, he says. Yeah. You're, a prophet, yeah. you're a prophet, he says, in his time. The wall, the wall, the barrier of Gog and Magog has been opened so much, so much. He is so terrified in his time. Actually, so, so, so Gog and Magog. How, okay. Actually, so how it. Muhammad was able to know that the the whole of Gog and Magog is open? Because he heard it from Allah. Okay. Are they out or not yet? Okay. Listen, because I remember also a hadith that says. Uh, that they are on the ground also. So maybe this is just for a specific time. Yeah, I agree with you. The Quran because, says, my friend, the Quran says, Allah, he created seven earth, right? Uh, yeah, so what? Okay, so every earth have a level I have of... No problem with that. Every, oh, okay. every, every, seven earth and seven heaven. Every earth have yeah, a level... No problem with that. Every earth have a level of a creature, is correct? I don't know about that. Maybe. What do you mean? I know that it's a seven earth, but I don't know. I I remember a hadith that says uh, that they are uh, digging up uh, until they are on earth. Okay. Where we are right now. All right. And, uh, so so. And every time they try to dig up. <coughs> All right. Listen, listen. Every oh, time they oh, try to dig oh, up, uh -huh. they, they they will say we are closed, and then because they didn't say. Uh, 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 inshallah, inshallah, we will get there every time. They will uh, not get there. You know the hadith, right? I know for sure. I know the hadith, absolutely. You know so, it. so you are saying to me so now. I so, okay. So you are saying. So you are uh, saying. Right. So you are saying to me, if you say inshallah, you can accomplish your mission, correct? No, this is about. The, no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying in this specific uh, moment. What moment? In this, in, in the Quran, I think because the problem with you is you take things out of context. Because if there is something in the Quran that says about fighting, for for example, it says something about uh, I saw some something about you. You said in the Quran says you can crucify someone's hands, but it doesn't say that. It it says that about a specific uh, time when Moses uh, was alive. But it was about the story that you can't read right there because you are you are, you are deceiver. Oh, okay. What if I show you now? It says you can crucify people. That's how you read. What if I show you now that you can crucify no, them? No, it was about a specific. No, it's it was about, about a specific time when no. uh, Moses was. Uh, no, alive. no. Here we go. Chapter five, verse number thirty-three. I got you busted. Here we go. Read it. You read out of context. I'm not reading. Here we go. We can open Ibn Kathir. And this is the Quran in front of you. I'm, I'm not talking about Tidhan Kathir. I'm talking about the Quran too. And the, why you make a theory will agree with me, not agree with you? So if this is was for mischief, did, 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 okay, did your prophet crucify people? No. Okay, let us see. He never killed people. So okay, let, let, us, let us see if this is true or not. Here we go. You are actually you. You have made these people, these brave people, in your Abdul. You too. Okay, read you, with me. Listen, listen, read, read, read with me. Read, 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 read with me. Read with me. He put nails in their eyes. He cut their hands and he cut their feet. Here we go. This is what they do in the crucifixion. This is why ISIS did do it. Read it. 
He put, no, but you didn't he, read the whole chapter. He, uh, here we go. I'm read the whole chapter. He did put nails in I their eyes. Let, he, he did. He put nails in their eyes. He blinded them. And the, 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 this is exactly what the Quran is saying: that those who do mischief in the earth, you cut their hands, you cut their feet, you cut their etc. And you crucify them. And, oh, Mu and Muhammad and Muhammad added. And people, they are look. They are back. They they beg for water. They are dying on the cross. Look at this. He gagged their eyes. This is your prophet. This is the this is the mercy of the prophet. The Muslim they say to us, the prophet was merciful. He put people in the cross. He cut their hands. The, the, the Roman is way more nicer. At least those people they put you in the cross. They don't do this. Muhammad he cut their hands. He cut their 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 feet, and then he put nails. He put it in fire, and he put it in their eyes. How do you say that the Romans crucified your God, man God? So how do you say they are nicer? So, okay, I'm saying they are nicer because simply the crucifixion is way nicer than this. This is this is way they more. Can, they killed your God. No, no, no. Hold on. You see the Roman. Okay, so the, 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 the Roman. You think the, killing your God is so, nice don't, 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 don't be a fool. I'm saying nicer as a way of killing, which means the, the way of killing is ugly anyway. But your prophet is way more ugly than even the Roman killing. So your prophet, your prophet, your prophet. Uh, in, enjoy your prophet enjoy torturing and you lie to me saying that the prophet and islam don't teach crucifixion your prophet and your god he is learning from the this roman this is the punishment of the roman this is the pagan practice why muhammad is using the pagan practice as punishment okay so you're not going to answer me I did answer you. You said to me, I lied about the crucifixion. I said, no, the Quran I, confirmed the crucifixion. And I said to you, we can go right now and read the interpretation. No, okay. No, so, okay, let us go. Listen, let us go. And read the no, I'm not here of context, uh, potato. Let me go to the, to the interpretation. Can we? I can go right now to the interpretation. Everybody either will laugh at me or at you. Chapter 5, verse number 33. Is it this is for the Jews or this is for the Muslims? We will see in a second. Here we go. We go to the yes, tafsir. Oh, no, 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 we don't yes, jump in. No, no, no. When you say something, when you say something to me, hey, hey, I, you see, you see, I, you see, I, 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 no, 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 I, I have to get you, but I know, I have to get you, but chapter five, verse number thirty-three. Chapter five, chapter five, verse number three. Why you don't want to read it? You said you want to get me. You said you want to get me busted. You said you said this is for the Jews, not for the Muslims. Did you just what you said? CP, don't shout. Read with me. Here we go. It says, okay, okay. The following, will, the following will, verse was revealed will, by Adam when they came to the Medina and etc. And then, as, as somebody suffered from illness, he told them to I'm go and, to go, and, and go and drink the camel urine and, 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 and milk. So, okay, the, the prophet know. here, who cares if you meet me or not? Get hang up, go, go. who care? Potato. So when you say I'm lying, you are the liar. Go and drink the camel urine, Dr. Muhammad, camel urine prescription. You see it in front of you. And then they say that story says that they, they gave their animals to the to the uh, to Muhammad, and then they want to get their animals back. The Muslim they say no, they are stealing. Doesn't matter what the story is. So they came to the shepherd, they killed the shepherd, and they ran away. And then Muhammad he sent his army after them. And he brought them and he crucified them. And this is what the verse is about. So when you are saying this is for the Jews and you are supposed to mean I'm, li I'm lying, that is a, your stupidity. This is Tafsir al You can see Ibn Abbas, you can see Ibn Kathir, you can see whatever you want. You are just a stupid kid who try his best to defend his prophet, but at least you are more brave than those who have a beard. You see, because those are kids and nobody count what they say, they can call me. But the one who have a career, he will never do that because that that will end his career. Are you going to mute me now? Okay. Okay. So is it about is it about the Muslims or about the Jews? You lie. You say this is about the Jews. Is it about the Jews or about okay. the Muslims? Okay, okay, let me just say one thing, yes? Is it about I'm the Jews? Serious. No, you have to, you have, because you accuse me of lying. Not, you, have, you, have, you, have to, you have to apologize before you continue. I, here we go, I have it in the front of you on the screen. Is this is a verse, a verse was given to the Jews or given to the Muslims to, be, to crucify people? I don't see it yet. 
I just gave you it's chapter 5 verse number 33 and you can read the interpretation open any one of them I have now Ibn Abbas in front of me I can open Ibn Kathir I just opened already a Jalalain all of them they say this is about crucifixion for those who do mischievous and revealed to the message of Allah revealed to the message of Allah in the city of Medina I don't uh, it's not on my screen it's not on my screen I will give you even Let's the name one I will give you I will, okay? I will give you I will give because you I will give you the link. I will give you the link. Here we go. Should I give you the link? Wallahi. Wallahi. Should, please, let me just say one thing. Well, wallahi, what will One thing, okay? What will I mean? Okay, please. What will I mean? Because you woke up my, no, for... woke up my parents. No, no. Because he was shouting. Please just don't shout, okay? Because I also can't my friend, shout now. Use, use the headphone. The... Don't you have a headphone? I don't have a headphone. You have money for me because you have a lot of money because of Patreon. Ah, I have a lot of please, money. Please. Okay, my friend, let us ask, is it okay to ask people to go to give money and go to heaven? Like the scam Muhammad? I don't I don't ask people to, hey guys, since I come here, did I say to anyone, go and make donation? Anyone heard me saying, hey guys, go and make donation? I don't, I go live on air, I, sh I, I, okay. I, I, I finish my broadcast, I say nothing. If people oh, they go, oh, if, oh, okay, no, 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 you see, hold on, you open a topic, it's very important, because the one who is the one who asks people to go and give money so they can go to heaven is your prophet. I don't promise people heaven, and I don't talk about it. I go no, live, my, serv my service is for free, I give my books for free, so if somebody okay, would help me because I okay, am helping them. No, 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 hold on. You, you said, oh. you, now you know, a second ago you do not know, you said you are doing it because you have money. Listen, so what kind of God, he asked, you don't get money? What kind? You what, don't get money? What, what, I don't ask for money. I don't ask them for money. I don't beg them for money. It's, you for it's money. your, it's your a prophet who claim. It's your prophet he claim that, that my teaching is for free. Your prophet is teaching is not for free. Is the teaching it of... Is for free. Okay, it hold on. Free. Okay, here we go. Guys, the teaching of the prophet is for free. You want to challenge me? It is for free. Do you want to challenge me? I can, I can go to a mosque and get the Quran for free. So uh, because he, uh, no, he's dead now. When he was there, you don't get it for free. So I'm asking you now. I do. I do. I'm asking you in the time. Of, in free. the time of Muhammad, was it for free or you have to what pay? Why are you talking about the time? I'm talking about. Uh, oh, I'm so, talking so, about so you are saying? Oh, free. you are saying Muslims today are better than Muhammad. So now it's for free in the time of Muhammad, is not? I didn't say that. Okay, I'm asking you in the time of Muhammad, was it for free? You said. I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying in the time of Muhammad, I lost my voice really, my, 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 my voice is okay, getting tired, go, okay, go, go. okay, so, okay, go, go. is it for free when your prophet, if you want to meet your prophet in a private consultation, let us say you came to the prophet and you said to him, uh, I, I want to talk to you, <coughs> is it for free? <coughs> it's uh, his teachings are for free yes yes i just ask you the question let me repeat the question if i come to muhammad you ask me if it's for free yes i come to muhammad i want a private consultation is it for free or i have to pay private consultation hmm. you're talking about appointment or something no i come to his house i come to his house it means i'm not speaking to everybody i came to his house i say prophet can i talk to you is it for free to talk to him I, I do, it depends. You mean on uh, Islam? In the time of Muhammad, if a guy he come to Muhammad to talk to him, is it for free? It depends. It ah, depends. On what you want to talk. depends. Why? Because he was a businessman. What? He was a businessman. To talk to him about Islam, to talk about Islam. So, uh, so agree. Muhammad is a businessman. Islam, Islam is a business. What is his business now? He's working full time as a prophet. What business? So, a man will talk to him. Can, can, he, can he? Can, okay, I want to come and ask him a question about Islam. Should I pay to ask him the question, or he would ask me for free? No, it's not. It's not uh, forced to pay. But if you want to give a donation, it's no problem. Ah, problem. okay, read with me. Oh, who you believe? Read, not read with, me, not read with me, read with me, read, read, read with me, read, read with me about your prophet scam. Oh, who you believe when you cancel the messenger in private, spend something in charity before your private consultation. Let us compare between me yeah. and your prophet. Did no you, problem. did I say to you, go and make donation to talk to me? No. Did I say to any of those people, go and make donation in order to hear me? No. Did I say you will not be able to... Where is this for? Where is this for? I don't see it. Cha it. Chapter 58, verse number... So don't think in charity before you... Chapter 58, verse number 12. 
Wait, wait, I see it, I see it. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, calm down. Yeah, Muhammad doing business. You want to talk to the Prophet, you have to talk to, you have to pay him. Yeah, but this is, yeah, but come on, CP, it, it says clearly charity. It, uh, for, for sure, it's about, uh, for sure, it's a charity, my friend. It's a charity. You are giving Muhammad everything is there, giving Muhammad a charity because Allah will reward you, brother. But it's going no, to, that, but it's going to the, the it's, it's, it's going to go to who? You see, okay, listen. Why I cannot? What if I am not even a Muslim? How I can talk to him? You will not be able unless you pay something. You have to do something. Okay. Why so, you want to talk to him? Jesus, to Jesus, Jesus I want to talk? ask him because Muhammad, he came to the non-Muslims so he can convert them to Islam. When he came, there's nobody who believe in him. So how come now he will not talk to you? Because yeah. now he became famous. He have, he's, a, he's on YouTube now. He have a big channel. He called himself his channel Mimi, 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 Boo Boo Shake, you know? And now you cannot talk to me unless you, uh, you know, you want to watch my video, you have to do pay subscription. This is false. This is a fraud. No, but you okay. Don't. This is not an you, act. This is not right. an act you're of right. a prophet. My videos are totally for no, free, no, you and, and not only for free, not only for free, I'm showing you the verse in front of you. I'm lying? No, but you... you for, 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 okay, listen, 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 okay, hold on, hold on. If, I, if, if you with the prophet... If you, are, if you are with the prophet was, now, if, if, you are, if you are with the prophet, and you are attacking Jerusalem with Hamas, and now you attack a house of a Jew, is it true that the Prophet will get the big TV? He will do what? He will get the biggest TV in the house. No, of course he's not. You acting like he's uh, Pablo Escobar or something that he has people uh, that he robs houses and all that stuff. Well, what are you talking about? Well, this is what the Quran is saying. The 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 best of the the best of the. It doesn't say that. It's okay. A charity. What charity? Hold on. The best, you know what charity if, is, if, if Muhammad, if Muhammad he attack, is it true that the best of the of the of the booty is going to him? So what? He is the leader. Okay, take care. So he... <laughs> I got the answer. So what? He is the leader. So what? He is the leader. He is the leader of the gang. Uh, the well, the leader he should be is if he is serving Allah it should not be about money why well, I want to get the big TV to my house they are the one who is dying for me to go and fight he just hit home why he get the the, the 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 best of the booty brother the furniture the expensive furniture to the prophet okay the flip flap is for you is it obvious that he is a scam All right anyway guys I can't stay longer really. I hope you have a good time. Did we have a good time? Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, what I do here, what I do is absolutely for free. I actually, I beg people to download my videos, to share them, to put them in their channels. If people make a donation, that's because they are helping, because I'm doing my best to help too. I can say all the books I'm giving for free, I'm not going to say it for free and forget about donation, and then I will make a lot of money from it. I have my my book translated to many languages. If each one of them, you know, each language of those languages gave me a thousand dollars a month, that's it, I will live fine. Yet I gave them for free. So don't tell me about donation. And we go live, and we finish life like long time ago we tried to open a tv station because it was very expensive and we could not make it we asked people to help nobody helped so we cancel but now we do not need it we have the internet is better before there's no life youtube there's no etc you have to do it yourself so when a muslim try to frame you and they are the one who believe in god if you give him money he give you paradise i say to you whoever say to you if you donate you go to paradise, he is a thief, he is a scam. Because in Christianity, you cannot bribe God. God, he count your work, but first he count your intention, your faith. What about? If you give because you want to help, not because you want to go to heaven, then that will count. But if you are trying to buy God, that work only in Islam. This is why the God of Islam, he says, who want to give Allah a mortgage? 
and Allah will double it for him. That does not work with Christianity. That does not work with Jesus. And God who big for money cannot be God. Did Jesus beg for money? The Messiah, he can raise people from death. Did he take wages? You're a prophet, you agreed that he will not talk to you in a private unless you pay him. My Lord, he raised the people from death for free. He made the blind see for free. He made the person who cannot walk, walk for free. And all the disciples, they do the same. And this is why the Bible says, for free you took, for free you give. Isn't it amazing? For free you took, 